question is this product worth 45000 rupees let's see if the dyson can fix this hi you guys my name is aishi badeka welcome or welcome back to my channel in today's video we are using the brand new dyson air app multi styler this product has so much hype and i am so excited to shoot it i've been waiting to shoot it by the way one because i finally got the air app and i wanted to style my hair with you second i really wanted to tell you if the product is worth 45000 rupees because the product has so much hype and you obviously want to know if it's worth your money or not so let's get into it so this is the box that the air app comes in it is such a pretty box I just opened it by the way and this is all that you get inside. This is the main air app machine. These are the six attachments that you get with so now it. Now that we've seen what the air app comes with, let's go ahead and dry my hair first. Okay, so this is what the main air app machine looks like. I love the new copper nickel color. This color is called copper nickel by the way. I'm putting on the blow dry attachment right now. Firstly, it's on the fly away barrel because you don't see the blow dry vents over here. All you need to do is turn it around from here and when you hear that click it's now turned into the blow dry mode and this is the vent through which the air comes by the way you'll be wondering why the you know the vent is so small it has so much power and the best part is when you blow dry your hair like this you know with your normal blow dryers you end up frizzing your hair so much because there's just so much over here that just comes up like your baby hair and stuff for me personally all i do is i blow dry my hair like this so when i'm blow drying it also the air flows in the in you know in the downward direction so anything that has to come up it doesn't really come up it just settles down in the first phase only let's have set my mode it's on the highest heat and the highest air flow let's go Okay, firstly, please excuse how my hair looks. I'm Wait a minute. I'm very embarrassed, but this is what my natural hair looks like when I blow dry it. I have really, really curly hair, and when you, you know, comb out your hair, when you blow dry your hair, this is what it looks like because you're just opening up all the curls. So anyway, let's see if the Dyson can fix this. Okay, so for the step two, I'm using this particular smoothing brush, which I don't usually use because I only go ahead and use that voluminizing brush. But I want to show you every every attachment, so I'm going to use this as well. Okay, so this is what my hair looks like after this attachment. I've used it all over the left hand side. and this is where i have not used it i've just blow dried this well you can see the difference a very very evident difference but uh my only concern with the dyson is that it doesn't usually last you know uh, honestly maybe because i live in bombay and it's been raining like crazy over here and there's just so much humidity in the air that your hair styles like you know when you use heat on your hair it's not going to last you So I'm just hoping and praying to God that once the monsoons go, my hair does look this nice for a longer period of time because I can't keep styling it again and again. But also one good part about the Dyson is that it really, really protects your hair from heat damage. Obviously, there is some sort of heat that they use, but it's not as much as your blow dryers or you know the curling tongs. I used to use it for the longest time until I got this. but now i don't use it i only use this this is what it is for now i will go ahead and use the smoothing brush on this side and come back cool so both the sides are done i've used a smoothing brush on both the sides i don't like how my hair looks from the bottom when i use this particular barrel because when i straighten my hair it just makes it look very rough on the ends and i don't like it at all and that's the reason i love this particular attachment so much because it just gives you like a natural bouncy finish i will show it to you right now when i use it it this honestly guys i've said it enough but i love this particular attachment the most <laughs> Okay, 
do you see this it is so so natural and this is what i love i love how my hair looks right now and this is what i do on a daily basis so yeah once i do the entire section you will know better what i'm talking about again take smaller sections so that your hairstyle lasts longer and it looks better <laughs> Okay, so pro tip: when you're using this attachment and when you want this effect, you okay. So when you're going ahead and doing this, you just comb your hair first. You twist it around like this, and you slowly, slowly release it. Take it downwards and go very, very slow so that it, you know, like the heat take is getting covered on all the sections of your hair. But towards the end, you know, when you see this part coming in, when all your hair is inside the barrel. just hold it in place for a good 3 to 4 seconds so that the heat on the lower ends is the most and when you release your hair like this when you release your hair you get this little you know curl towards the end and that's what i live for i love it Okay so this part is done and this is honestly my everyday go to hairstyle I don't do anything else do you see that bounce and the volume and everything it's so beautiful wherein you know the part is very straight and it it's already just you know starting to move and it's not straight anymore it's just wavy because my hair is naturally very curly so this stays put longer and this looks better Tell me in the comments below which one would you like more, straighter side or this side? I personally love this. It just looks so natural. Okay, so both my sections are done, and I love how my hair is looking right now. But there's one more thing that I do for my money pieces. I take both of them like this, like this for the extra bounce. I take both of them like this. First, I comb it around like this over here. Okay. This is only for the extra bounce if you want. I usually do it a lot. Then you turn it around like this and then you keep curling it like this. But I'll do it with the machine on. I I will not be able to speak once the machine's on. So yeah. So this is what I usually do for the extra bounce in the money piece area because I love it. Looks very very natural and nice. Yes. Okay, so now this is my everyday hairstyle. We'll go ahead and curl my hair now. Now I'm going ahead and using the most popular curling barrel. I'm using the 40 mm. Again, take smaller sections. That's the key to you know very good looking hair i'm taking a very small section here that's one thing second thing you can twist it around like this the way you want it now i'm going to curl this side i'm going to keep it over here then you just need to start it i go all the way up Hold it for a good seven to ten seconds, and then give a cool shot. Cool shot is also very, very important. Now I'm giving the cool shot, and then I'll release it. Cool shot should be for ideally three to four seconds. That's it. We're done. Now I'm gonna remove my hair like this, and just going to. Hold the curls like this, and leave it. the last 
piece for the section. One little problem that I have with this curling barrel is that it gives me a lot of flyaways. Do you see this versus this? There are just so many flyaways at the moment because there's so much air flowing from everywhere that all your baby hair is going to like just pop up. But anyway, we have that attachment to fix it. So this is what my curls look like. I'm not going to open it right now. I'm just going to let it be until I finish this section and you just open it with my fingers. Okay, so we're done curling both the sides. This is what this side looks like. And this side looks like this. I love it. But before we go ahead and open the curls, I'm gonna go and fix this first. We will use the flyaway barrel and fix all the flyaways right here. Now it's on the blow dry vent right now. We just need to switch this to this now it's on the air wrap mode oh sorry the fly away mode i don't know what's wrong with me let's see if this has actually fixed the fly away problem it has to some extent but i was still scared to take it down because then it you know started to blow dry like started to put air on my curls and that would just spoil my curls so i think Another pro trip is do it before you curl your hair because you might just spoil your curls. I think I already spoiled this curl over here but we can't do anything. So I'm going to open my curls now. You just need to slide your fingers through your hair and it will open up on its own. <laughs> I think just don't comb your hair just just do this once or twice and leave it because it's anyway going to open up when you step out this really doesn't last you a lot I'm gonna tell you that if you if you live in a place where there's a lot of humidity it's not gonna last you a lot but enjoy it while it lasts okay so now we're finally done with my hair I personally love it. Tell me in the comments below if you loved how my hair is looking. And let's get to the main question. Is this product worth 45,000 rupees or not? What I personally believe is I was someone who was curling or straightening or, you know, just styling my hair with regular heat tools. And I do think uh, that, you know, when I'm doing my hair, it's, it's not, you know, giving it a lot of heat or it's not heat damaging it a lot because you know if you would have seen in the video when i was curling it i was easily being able to touch my hair as well which doesn't happen when you're curling it with your tongs and stuff like that right because it's really really hot and that does do a lot more heat damage to your hair compared to this so if you're someone who styles your hair regularly like me i style my hair almost every single day right so for me it's a great investment this will be like an investment but if you're someone who styles your hair once in a while uh, you know just to go out for parties and stuff you might as well stick to your basic heat tools which are not going to cost you so much because if you're not using it enough then you're not getting the most use out of it you're just using it once in a while so you might as well use those heat tools and get done with it but if you want this it's a great product to have I love it. I'm just waiting for the Bombay monsoons to get over so that I can just roam around with this hair all day long and not, you know, like just not be scared of my hair getting flat again or whatever. But overall review, I love how my hair is looking. I've never had my hair looking so bouncy and, you know, so fresh ever with any of the heat tools that I personally have. I would curl it and it will be really tight curls, which I would open up with a comb. And that would still be curly, but I, I, I don't say that I don't like that look. I love that look, but this is a new look and I, I do like it. It's a very fresh, bouncy, healthy hair, kind of a hairstyle and a hair look. So if you want to buy it, you should totally go ahead and buy the new multi-styler because this flyer attachment 
really really makes a difference i personally love it because i have a flyaway problem and it if this could fix that then take my money take my money and just give it to me because i really wanted to fix this issue so yes overall i love the product let me know if you would buy it and let me know how you like it oh also i forgot to tell you don't forget to like share subscribe to my channel i am going to be a lot more active on youtube if you don't follow me on instagram i'm leaving my instagram handle somewhere here on the screen go ahead and follow me there and don't forget to subscribe to my channel i'll see you next time bye